exceedingly hard for me to place a label on what we've heard other than racketeering. Good old fashioned mobster racketeering. But on a grand scale. One of my favorite statements um, comes from James Madison. If men were angels, no government would be needed. If angels were to govern men, neither external nor internal controls on government would be necessary. In framing a government which is to be administered by men, over men, the great difficulty lies in this. You must first enable the government to control the governed, and the next place oblige it to control itself. Ladies and gentlemen, I have not seen one single government entity in the United States ever give up a scintilla of power once it seized it. We have endless, exec endless executive orders from mayors, from governors, and I'm not hooting on our governor, I'm hooting on all governors. You don't have the authority to make me safe. That's my job. It's interesting to me, I'm gonna repeat this, why so many people call for civil rights to be, for, to be fortified, to be enforced, to be protected, but there's virtually no call for the most supreme civil right, and that is for our franchise to give the consent to be governed. What we're experiencing right now is a form of tyranny that is insidious. I hope that out of this, besides calling for a special session, which I am doing right now, we see a, a series of grand juries convened. Yes, sir. There is so much criminal behavior that has gone on in this state and states around the country. I believe that it's time for our Attorney General and the U.S. Attorney to start perp walking some people.